Hi everyone, this is Gleb Bachmanov. So I'm still playing Wordle, and right now I let my solution algorithm pick the first random word out of all allowed words. And for example, right now it picked that, and if I run it again, it will pick something else. Now I want to add a mode where I can provide a starting word myself. So let's modify our code to allow to enter a five-letter word to start with and then pass it from outside. I'm going to take uh, the latest spec file and I'll rename it start. Okay, I'm going to close everything else, collapse it, move it to the side, move Cypress to the side, and what do we have here? Well, we start right here by clicking on the close, right? That closes the initial dialog and then trying the next word from the list. So we don't need anything here, and we'll rename it provided word. And what kind of word do we want to say? Uh, I mean, start is a five-letter word. Well, VS Code complains because try next word doesn't allow for second argument. So we'll say word, okay? This is where we pick the word, but we also provide it. So we'll say, if there is no word, then pick it yourself. Okay, so that will fix it. And let's switch to our new spec, start. Okay, so notice it starts with the start. And then it actually picks the next word depending on the response. Here's something else we can do, right? We can read this word, right, from Cypress and Envirp object. Okay, so... In this particular situation, I took the spec that sent the hint. We don't need anything here, just like this. So I'm going to remove this code, and that means we don't need number of hints. And instead, we'll read the starting word from the dummy variable. So here's what we'll do. We'll say word equals cypress and start word, or if it's not provided start. All right, and we'll pass it to the try next word function. So again, right now it will say start because we didn't provide anything. Now how can we provide a word? Well, we can restart Cypress with environment option. So we could say I don't know, npx Cypress run and, and then start word equals start or let's say later. But if we're already running, we can say Cypress and start word and then give the initial word ourselves. Now this will stay in memory, so unless we do hard browser reload, Cypress and will have start word later. So let's see this. Beautiful. We started with a word we found in a Cypress and object. So just for kicks, right, why don't we allow the user to enter this word when they kick off a workflow from the GitHub action UI? So here's what we'll do. I'm going to go here and I'm going to change this to start and I'll call it start. Okay, we're going to leave everything here. We don't need the hint. We'll say start word, the first word we try. And it's going to be a string and required true because we want to provide this. Okay, um, we will not use a cron job for this. Okay, so what do we have here? Notice how we pass the environment variable for Cypress env object. We use the env property of Cypress GitHub action. So we'll say start word. And what's the name in Cypress that we use? Start word. Okay, that looks reasonable. And the only other thing, the name of the spec we want to run is start. The same spec we see on the right. We don't need anything here because we're not email anything to the user, we're just running this. And I think this is it. And the only other thing, ah, we'll email this letter. Okay, so I'm gonna exit. I'm gonna push the change code to the repository. Okay, here's my repository. If I go to actions and I go to start, I can say run workflow and notice, well, this is uh, something that we could use if we emailing. And the first word to try would be super. If you look at the workflow, look at the job, OK, 
Okay, so we're starting the start spec. You should have passed the env with a start word from what I entered. Now, unfortunately, we don't see the result. So let me set up Cypress dashboard recording. Okay, I'm going to go to runs, connect to the dashboard. This is my open source. And I will make it public. I'll set up Cypress environment record key. Record key. Add it as a secret. Now, all I have to do here when I run Cypress GitHub action for this particular workflow, I'll say record true and I'll tag it with start word so I can easily find it. And I have to provide Cypress record key environment variable and that comes from secrets Cypress record key that I just set right here. And we'll go back to the start stack. So once we solve it, okay, I'm going to remove this and we'll say size screenshot start word and that's it. So we're going to take a screenshot of a solved puzzle. Okay, we pushed the changes. Let's go back to our actions, start workflow, run it. What's going to be our word? Uh, let's say super again, our workflow is running. Okay, now notice that we are recording so there is Cypress dashboard URL. It's tagged with start word so we can easily find it among our recordings. Okay, it's solved it. Let's look at screenshot. And this is the screenshot of the game. Notice we did start with a word we entered when we launched this workflow. Pretty cool.